Hi everyone, Ventatech is in touch. My name is Vasily and today I'm going to show you how to do an instant inventory of any product in your Odoo warehouse. It's useful if you need to do an initial inventory, cycle count or just update any product on the go. Well, imagine we have an empty warehouse in our auto inventory. I mean, we've just started our business or have a fresh auto installation. Goods are on shelves, but not in the system yet. Let's check it. I scan any item. I see the quantity on hand is zero or just scan any bin and see that it's empty. Now let's add everything to the system. For this, let's open Venter application and instant inventory menu. Here we see two lines, location and product. Location and the product from this location. We see a warning that there is no items in this location. It's correct because we haven't added it yet. Uh, let's add it. So one and apply and update inventory. That's it. Easy. And now I can add other products. Update inventory. That's it. Sometimes me as a warehouse manager just walking through my warehouse and checking uh, shelves randomly and if I find difference I can easily update stock in a few seconds. Let's say I want to check this shelf. Hmm. I see that should be only one good but it's two. Uh, sometimes it happens in the warehouse, you know, okay, no problem, let's just update inventory to keep our stock up to date. That's it. This option is also useful if you set cycle count for some location or product. Your workers can just go to needed location once a day or once a week and easily update or confirm inventory. It often happens that pickers can't find needed products on a related shelf while doing picking. By the way, here is a video about picking. So I'm doing picking, the app guides me to bin 2 to take one notepad. But I see that it's empty. It's important to update quantity right now, not to waste time in the future. Let's do it. So I go to product info, update quantity. Choose the location and set zero for this. Now we can return to our picking to take product from uh, another location and continue our picking. Why the shelf is empty? It's a good question, but it's not important right now. It matters to quickly and easily update inventory and sync it with Odoo. Often serial numbers aren't added uh, on receiving but applied on picking, packing or delivery. Venter allows doing this easily. Watch how. With the instant inventory menu, you can assign serial number at any moment. I will show how. For example, this MacBook from bin 4. Let's check its product moves. We see that this product was recently received and hasn't been moved yet. It's good that we found this product without serial number while nobody picked it. Ok, let's go back and add serial number. First of all, we need to update this quant, set quantity 0 and create a new one here but with serial number. Scanning the product and the serial number. The app show, shows a warning that there is no serial number but suggests to enter it. So let's add and 1, update inventory. A bit tricky but it's how Odoo works. Another important point is expiration dates. If you sell such goods, you know how it matters to always have relevant information about this date. I know this green tea has no expiration date in our system, so let's add it. Uh, scanning it. Uh, choosing lot number. Mm -hmm. By the way, the application shows us only lot numbers from current location. And let's add expiration date. For this go to three dots, set expiration date. Uh, it expires on 
June 30. And update inventory. That's it. Easy. Now this product one will be properly reserved by Odoo to ship in time. But it's another story. Sometimes it happens that you find a product in your warehouse that is damaged or defective. In these cases you need to scrap it from your warehouse. Let's do it with Ventor. Ok, scanning product, location, uh, quantity, go to three dots, scrap, we see a warning and agree. That's it, it's scrapped. Hmm. By the way, looks good, I will take it. As you see, the instant inventory menu allows doing serious things with your goods. Add, remove, scrap them, etc. So make sure you provide access to this menu only to reliable users. This is all for today. Now you know how to quickly update your inventory using Vendor Mobile App. Don't forget to subscribe and as usual waiting for you in the comments with your questions. See you! Bye!